Legend of Total War here with part 107 of my This is Total War Attila Western Roman Empire Let's Play campaign. Previously we had a big defense here at Silly's and um, silly name um, and yeah we defeated them so that was good. And now army's still in pretty good shape because obviously they recovered. Now these guys here they're probably in shit shape. Okay so it's been repaired. Need to um, Convert it. Levy center, destroy that. Destroy. How are you looking? Good? You're in full strength. It's too bad you can't get all the way out here. Can't. Oh, right, they're in force march. Um, I guess that wouldn't be too bad, though, if we did go out there in force march. Looks like we can reach there. The thing is, next turn, winter attrition's coming back. So we should try and get as far as possible over here, even if it does mean will be in Force March Journey stance. Completed. I mean, they couldn't possibly have much Make left over men. here, right? Destiny. Well, we'll find out soon enough, I guess. These guys here, we battle. just need to... Yeah, try and get rid of these if you can. To battle. Just auto resolve it. I know I could use Night Attack to do it one at a time, but we don't have time to muck around with that. So just kill all three and we'll let go. Uh, a lot of casualties. Doesn't matter though, because we're right on their ass over here. And that's what we need to be doing. Ride their ass right to hell. Um, yeah, stay here. You'll need to recruit another unit. We lost some cavalry, but that's okay. Just hire one of them. I don't think we actually know. I will send you out this way. Give this guy some backup. Right there. There's no mercs out here, so two armies will go and defeat Muramar. They don't seem to have anything. Good. That means we don't need these guys to go up there any further. So those three should be more than enough to handle Moromar. I think you... Let's let's um, start occupying more of these territories and make our way down... Down the Eastern Caspian. Advance. Get rid of more Sassanid vassals. And those guys, after they've taken out them, they'll have to probably hunt down the Sclavenians. And all these territories out here. How are you going? Got a lot of money, but... Uh, well, now I guess would be an alright time to, to take another settlement. Uh, we are better off taking more in this province to begin with, though, I think. Yeah, come over here. Take that. I know we're not fully recovered, but it doesn't matter. There's no one out here. Yeah, it's 11,000, 9,000. No big difference. Just get it done. So this region's being taxed now. Um, public order's actually not very good. That's okay. Destroy that because that, that gives us better access to a public order building. Actually, don't worry about that right now. This needs to grow. Alright, good. And how are we going over here in the east? Okay, Nisibis is restored. What's the garrison like there? It's nearly full strength. Arbala seems to have been left poorly defended. These guys still have a famine going on. I think. Is that right? Yep. Desertion causes unit attrition. That's great. Okay. But is this region actually producing any food? It is, despite the fact that... Yeah, so we don't want to take that off them. I would 
Because right now they're in a really weak state. We want to be taking away territories. Actually, no, 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 we do want to take that away from them because it's producing food, of course. We don't want to be taking away regions that aren't producing food. So, for example, Tesafon over here. Minus 140 food. They're all in a weakened state. Yes, let's take our blood. It doesn't matter if this army dies, but come over here and take it. I reckon that there'll be a Sassanid counterattack. Not up against much, just auto resolve it. Taking the settlement away from them will, of course, take away more of their food. They'll be even more into starvation. I don't think it'll make any difference towards, you know, making them take more attrition, but whatever. Sculptor, what is this? Oh, hell no, I don't need... I don't need that, that's fucked, get rid of it. Builder's Workshop. Huge amounts of public order problems from that. Yeah, don't want to tax it. Yeah, come down here, just keep an eye on them. I fully expect that this region will get smashed in the end turn. That's okay, they can't recover their casualties. Still not available. I could send you down here. Wait, who are you? You're just nobody. Okay, come over here, let's take Ekbatana. What's that transport? I don't know what they're doing out in the water there, but I don't care. Assassinids aren't strong enough to take it back off us. Let's occupy it. At your command. Okay, city. Yep, repair that. Yes, repair that. That's actually providing a lot of good stuff. Um, Persian Library, get rid of it. Actually, can we convert it to something? To food make it. We already have one here, though. That's gotta go. That's gotta go. That's gotta go. Okay, we'll convert that to food maker. Yep. Cool, and now we just need to take that territory, which we can reach, and they'll have no more regions and they'll start starving. What's going on with you guys? Okay, yeah, I'll just upgrade them all, even though I think it's a bit of a waste. We got heaps of money. Okay, they couldn't possibly have many, many units here. Because they're big stacks out this way. The rest of them are beaten to shit since the, their defeat here. They've left nothing here. Good. We hunger for battle. Okay, so now they're starving. That guy cannot make it out to Gazanga, Genzanga, in one turn. So we'll send these guys over there to help. Here, get these upgrades. What is it? Just level one weapons. Well, whatever. It's better than nothing. Get over here. We hunger for battle. So you can be upgraded to Magister Militum. What's the difference? Apart from being a lot more expensive, they are much better fighters. No doubt about that. As opposed to Palantini Guard. But I need to see what the difference is between Comes and them. Okay, slightly more me missile, uh, melee attack. One more charge. Two more melee defense. I wouldn't say it's really that big of a diff uh, difference. I mean, the same speed or whatever, but yeah. Big deal. Okay, so this province here, how's the pub? Oh, we need to send someone back over here. Right. Uh, you're not going to have enough um, movement to squash it completely. Commander. 
to stay there to, for public order reasons and to keep an eye on them. It's good that they're starving. Okay, out this way we've got Arbashar. Sassanids down here though. But I reckon those Sassanids are... What's going on with you? I don't know. I think they're they're damaged. Hmm. Well, whatever. Even if we lose these armies, it doesn't matter that much. Even if I lose the emperor. I mean, I don't want to, but that ship. I mean, is there a river here? No. No. Well, we'll do what we can. Okay. Let's see. Uh, militia encampment. Right. Camel ranch. 130 food. Thank you. That's awesome. Weaver. Don't need that. Get rid of it. Alright, you're back at full strength, sort of. Let's come over here. And you're at full strength. Come over here. And what about this other navy? Full strength. Let's go. And you, come over here. Yeah, I don't care about how much it costs. We can disband the navies once we we've got full win. control over the sea anyway. It is an honor to serve Rome. Oh shit. That guy wasn't in them. position. The waves still beckon. Ready for orders. Moving okay, out. still got enough movement. Prepare for battle. Yeah, that's it. You better run. Not into those waters. And now we take this. Good, looks like an easy win. This gives us, I think, near full control of these waters and also give these guys a chance to recover their, their few casualties. Is there nothing else? Ready for battle. Good. At your command. Integrity's a little bit low here, but I don't care. So they're not recovering, but these guys are. Alright, we can head over to Hermosia later. And that gives us full control over this province, but how long we're going to hold on to this, I do not know. So this is level 4. We don't want to have level 4 settlement, because this is infertile territory. So we'll do that. We'll do that. Need more growth for that. Oriental port. Just knock it down one level. Fountains. Because that's a spice port. Uh, fountains is good. Need that. Sounds good. Stone cutter. Get rid of it. Okay, a good region, Amar now. Amarna. Uh, food market, repair. Repair, repair, repair. Commander. That's still converting. Once that's converted, there's no way these guys are going to be able to make an attack. Cause we'll have a big garrison there. That's okay if they just want to stay here. Keep them busy while we go take out their last few territories. And there's also the Sassanid one over here, which we can go strike. And also Meshan. Hopefully they've got plenty of food that the Sassanid are absolutely relying on. We'll take it away from them. Alright, what else are we going to do? Don't think there's much else. I really don't think I need this navy anymore. I mean, there are absolutely no naval forces out in the Mediterranean, apart from my guys. The problem is though, I cannot replace these guys ever again. Until a patch comes out. Doesn't matter. Goodbye, give me some more money. Alright, let's build. Let's have a look here. Okay. Uh, no, don't worry about this region right now. What can we build here? The public order seems stable. Actually, it is stable. What's going on? Let's have a look. What are the problems? We've got immigrants. That'll go down over time. Food Emporium, we've got Reservoir, we've got that. Can't really do anything else in regard to public order apart from build these up. But the thing is, these here, it'll still be under control even after that's done, so that's fine. Okay, Cordoba, it's fine. 
Oh wait, there was a reason why we destroyed that, because it's consuming too much food, actually. Looking at that, they actually have enough to purchase that, but still just do it anyway. Have a little bit of surplus. That's fine, Bithynia. Seems finished, even though it's not. Hang on, that's going to consume an additional 50 food. Knock Nicomedia down a peg. Because I need that. I mean, we could get some more food if we converted these Nisean stables, but... Oh, hang on a second. Just upgrade that. That'll provide enough food for it. And then a stable. Good. All these crappy regions I've got out here. That's no longer required. But just leave it until we get Divine Victory. It's not too much longer now. It's going to be a while before we can grow this. Oh well. There's plenty of food here, but what can we do to upgrade it? Public order seems fine, so I guess we can get away with building that stuff, and that's being built as well, so might as well. It's all good. Actually, I think I'll upgrade these to level 3, because that'll provide a bit more growth, and that's all we can afford to do. Good. It wasn't too long ago that that was desolate. It's all getting done. Alright, that needs to be upgraded. Politics, that's all good. We're at war with everyone. Yep, there's still quite a few factions left, but they're slowly dying. Uh, nice. Spy, who cares about you? Just do whatever you want. Commander. At your command. All good. Uh, it'd be great if we can finish off Abascia in this video. Hopefully they don't have any more stupid armies hanging around anywhere. Just finish them off. Then go hunt down the Sclavinians. Kill off all the other Sassanid vassals. And then finally take out the Sassanids. Wonder who's going to be the last to die. What are these Sassanids up to? What's with the roads flashing? Seriously, what are these Sassanids up to? So they're not willing to make the attack because, of course, they are starving. They did leave and uh, leave someone behind, though. What are you up to? Probably trying to make it back home before we get there. To rape all your fucking cities. Okay, looks like they do want to have an attack here. Which is weird that they're not sending yet other units to help. Well, that's an easy order resolve right there. Goodbye, motherfuckers. So they'll make stupid attacks until they can get themselves a hand of a city. As long as we never let them have anything. All good. That's just a garrison. All good. Our tropatine's gonna fall apart. Nothing 
Two interesting things going on there. What did that say? Obtain a trade agreement with Abaskia. You must be insane. Alright, whatever. Got heaps of money. It must be from demolishing stuff. Anyway, that's bound to be their one and only army. Tell you what, if this is the end of Abaskia, I'm going to be happy. I always like seeing the end of enemies. March. To victory! Tell me that's the end of them. Ready for battle. I think it was. Yes, good. So that's less people that we have to worry about. It's an eastern faction dead. So how many factions remain now? Wrong thing. So there's eight other factions. One of which are the Sclavenians and the Atropatines. They're... They're weak. Commander. Because yeah, he's starving. We should probably go out and fight him. Look at that, you're in full strength. Ready for orders. Yeah, fight him and get rid of him. Get rid of all of them so that they actually just disappear. Because it looks like they're actually coming to Gazang uh, Ganzanga or whatever it's called. Ganzaga. At your command. Yeah, get rid of this rebellion. To battle! Leave none alive! Advance. Good. Ready and you can battle. keep. Uh, you gotta have to find somewhere to stay for winter. If you come over here, I don't think the winter attrition affects too much over this way. I'm surprised Ready. that the uh, assassinates didn't try and take this back. Actually, can you force march to Nisibis? Nisibis? Yeah, I would have fucking called. They've left Tessaphon, but if we take Tessaphon, see it's only minus 30 food now. now are they still starving? Look at that there. Maybe they're coming down south to deal with this. Police reporting. That guy's coming over here to deal with it. We hunger for battle. Hey, we shouldn't be staying in the port now. So if we attack, um, if we lose, they don't get completely sunk. We shouldn't be leaving that unit here. It's not going to be that useful. You leave this one behind. Actually, them. They're probably the best to handle it. Actually, it makes no difference. They're probably the best, so who cares. Um, what happened to that other navy? For honor and glory! You come over here and raid. How much is this trade worth? Uh, right, trade route worth. If you raid it, it's worth three thousand. You're worth nearly five thousand, so that's not really what I'd call worth it. So there's a settlement out here that belongs to the Sassanids. Just not sure if that's what I should be doing, or should be preparing for these guys. Actually, it might be okay to just let them have the city and then just order resolve take it back. That'll save me more time. Okay, so that region has fixed itself up. It's got a nice garrison there. Alright, now the question remains. Do we come up this way to attack? Or should we go restore some... I think we'll go restore some settlements. And he'll just do whatever he's going to do. At your command. And that's no concern of mine. Journey completed. Yeah, go all the way. There's no one out this way. So come and restore the settlement. And we'll make our way over here and we'll see. We'll try and keep the uh, assassinids into starvation as much as possible. So if you look over here... Doesn't look like they're restoring any units. Ah, they get a lot of food because it's autumn. Maybe, I don't know. An easy way to find out if they are still starving is actually just push this unit down south. It doesn't want to fight. We'll have to bring in another one. I'm not actually here to kill it. I'm here just to see if they are still in starvation. Um, they can't come any further. You'll have to come down here. Push him down south. 
they are still starving. Which makes me reluctant to take Tessaphon. Yes, it's their capital, but... These guys are in a weakened state, we should leave them like that. I want hourly patrols. How can I serve Rome? Let's keep an eye on what... Did you get deceived, did you? Yeah, assassinate this wanker then. So, these guys... Yeah, see, they're preparing for my navies. Now, let's see here. Susa, is that providing food? Nope. Sapahan, is that providing food? Nope. Is Meshan providing food? Yes. Okay, so we should probably take that away from them. Keep them starved. Oh, so we need to we need to crush these guys. We've got to watch out. They'll take Ganzanga. Um, you'll have to force march there. You two should be easily able to crush this guy here. And then even make it over here to finish them. Yeah, because if we're going to finish the faction off, it doesn't matter if that gets taken by, say, Parthia. Who cares? Advance. We hunger for battle. Okay, come to here. Make haste, men. Same with you. And then we'll have him make the attack because he's got the most movement. Attack this one here so they reinforce. Yep, figured he'd run away. Well, man, that's running away a bit far. I'm afraid we cannot. None of us can reach him. Ready for orders. Not even you. We cannot follow this order. That's a bit shit. Should have sent him out the other way. Alright, well then you make the attack on this one. March. Yeah, we can't fucking reach him, but he is still trapped. Just have to get him next turn. Uh, finish him off this guy will help out. And that'll get him off Force March as well, for participating. See? Is that all? He still technically is on Force March, it just doesn't say that he is. I was hoping to finish them off, but I guess not. Uh, force march down to Raga, make sure it's defended. I, mean, I don't really care if it gets taken, but... Might as well defend it. Uh, what's this? Persian Library? Get rid of it. Don't need any more research. Wait, I was going to convert that to something. Yeah, that's right. Food market. That camel ranch, that's great. Lots of food coming from that. At your command. Yeah, it's a shame that we couldn't quite reach this guy, but... I'm afraid we cannot. That's okay. Maybe get him next turn. Because he... can't get very far. How can I serve Rome? They might try and take Arbola back, but... I don't care. Statue, yeah, get rid of this. Get rid of that. Convert that. It's good, Nisibis is under control. Alright, so my navies. We know that they're uh, preparing for it or something. Maybe I should harass Macron some more. I don't know. But what about this navy out here? If I take control of that port, then we've got control of this area. We'll recover for t uh, casualties. Set up a blockade! You know what? I'm inclined to actually let that army come and take Omana back. Just let it. You come over here as well. We can't quite make it. That's okay. I don't think this guy will mess with us. And just to make sure. That's defending it. Oh, it's just the one there. Okay. We'll need to still get in just a little bit closer. Make sure we minimize casualties. Okay. 
part of the port, orders. but don't actually stay in there. At your command. Your orders. Make sure you protect. Oh, actually, oh, who cares? We hunger for battle. Looking good. All right, how are we going down here? Yeah, they're recruiting. They won't be much longer, and then they can send back up here. And I don't think we need any more navies. So it looks like um, it's not going to take us too long to control this this little um, this tiny sea here. Sea of Persicus. So I'll put some money in here. See if they if they take the bait. If they want to come and occupy, they might just come here and sack it. Don't destroy that. Convert that to our culture. Leave that be. Build that up. Public order. No, leave the public order as it is. Don't mess with that right now. Okay, good. How many settlements do we have? So we've got 148. So we've we've passed the requirements needed for divine victory there. We still don't have our veteran garrison quarter. Nor do we have the necessary territory here. That's okay. We're getting that. Germania. Okay, whatever. So you, you're growing. You, yeah, don't go and take any more settlements just yet. So out here, these guys have been defeated. I might send you down south. Well, actually, I'll send you up north here. Come and take this territory. It doesn't matter if they take lots of attrition. Who cares? Your orders. None will escape. Commander. Take these settlements. What the fuck? Now, this was never populated, I think. It's just tiny, very, very tiny settlement. We hunger for battle. At Raha. Okay, whatever. Um, if you guys can escape the winter attrition down here, that should be fine. I doubt we're going to meet anyone down this way. Should have forced marched in the first place down here. At your command. Next turn, they can take this settlement, which is... Uh, so, right, start making our way down here. <laughs> They're going to recruit a whole bunch of mercenary onagers. That's not going to save them. Priestess. Yeah, the settlements out here are too strong for them to handle. Way too strong. Who knows, they might take another settlement, but I'll... Uh, I'll come back to stop them. They'll never be as strong as they once were. Party is hanging out here. Bunch of losers. Alright, let's uh, spend the money. Yeah, that's right. Can't do much here. Not until it grows. Wait, did we took out that... Oh, that's right. Then we moved down there. Right. The quarter here is not very good. What's going on? Well, it doesn't help that it's just suddenly just come back into play this area, so maybe I shouldn't tax it. Keep it under control. That'll help public order as well. Okay, we got that. We need sanitation. Okay. Nope, not going to have that. Destroy it. Because we're going to build salt here and um, food market. So it's producing plenty of food. Because the region here, public order wise, is completely under control. Public order is all good here, out here. Uh, yep. I think I will build the level 4 thing out. Hang on, wasn't I building it in Ganzanga or something? Whatever it's bloody called. Camel Ranch, yep, good. Threadmaker, get rid of it. Sanitation, right. So that was... here. And yeah, it's being converted. One more turn. 
Uh, we don't need that, right, do we? So we're converting that to food emporium. Because we I know we've got still got a um yep, that's there. Wait. No, we don't need to do that. We can go wine emporium, and then you can build that back up. Public order and sanitation should all be good here, right? Yep. I've got no more money anyway. Okay, that's all done. That's all done. Let's move on. It's good to see the Sassadids falling apart. Due to internal problems and external problems. The Roman Empire is slowly crushing them into a vice. Their vassals are being thrown apart. Even their blessed enemies are being killed. The Abascians. Should have united with them. What's that guy doing? Did I just forget to move him or something? Assassin's turn always takes forever. Come on, hurry up. They're no longer starving. They must have fixed their food problem. That's a problem. They'll recover very quickly without that. That being said, they've left Tessaphon completely undefended. Well, poorly defended. The thing is, though, if we don't start getting rid of some of their armies, they're going to start getting close to us. As in, we're going to have to deal with all their armies. Okay, yeah, so you're going to come over there. You're either going to sack it or occupy it. Either way, I don't care. Nope, they just besieged it. Wait, is that a fleet? If that's a fleet, we need to send a navy to go kill it. It is a fleet. Okay, we've only got one navy left in the Mediterranean. And that's you guys. Off you go. Go hunt it down. Good. Good, good, good. Alright, now what are we doing? Yeah, I just must not have moved him. Doesn't matter, he couldn't go to that settlement anyway. Okay, so that's been built, and then we need to build it up one extra level. Okay, you guys, I know you guys have taken lots of attrition. I don't care. Just come over here, occupy this. Looks like a bullshit town. Yep, it is. Come over here and then fortify. March. Get the Good. Lots up. of recovery. Ready for orders. And you Commander. over here. At your command. Very good. Oh man, this region was must have been desolate the entire campaign. Don't tax it. And you guys, um, let me see here. So, the Sclavinians, they're out there. We've still got to occupy quite a lot of territory out here. Still a lot of work to do. And how's this guy over here going? Ready for orders. You can probably wait another turn. But then again, the sooner we get this done, the better. Because yes. every settlement we take That's over helps the region grow. Doesn't matter if it costs a lot to build it up. I know I could have waited an extra turn, it would have been cheaper, but I, like I said, who cares? Gets this done faster. There's no more corruption to be had. I can start coming down this way. Some of it does seem desolate. Transcarpia, but that's okay. We hunger for battle. 
Alright. Let's kill battle. this guy off, and that should finish off the to faction. Victory! Kill the cowards! You have further orders? Ten minutes into that faction. Excellent. Alright, and I think with that we'll end the video there. So the situation's looking very good. How strong am I compared to the Sassanids? My Sassanids are weak now. They've got less than three provinces. We've taken all this territory away from them. In fact, all this as well, and this, that they used to own. own. They're down to half their strength, and all my armies are now starting to descend down this way. But there's still one... Are they their... They're a military ally, they're not a vassal. So Macron's still quite strong. They've got two regions left. Aria's got... No, actually, Macron's got one region left. Aria have two regions. Abishar have one region. Parthia have two. Africans have one. Sassanids have eight. But how long do they expect to hold that for? Now, they've also... What's it called? Um, they're no longer starving, so they're going to recover their forces very quickly. We need to take away their food. I'm just hoping it's Siraf. That's where they're sort of depending on their food. Let's have a look. They're getting 80 food from here. If we take that away from them, I'm pretty sure... Well, actually, I have no idea. But uh, there's a chance it will make them starve. And that's vital, I think. If we can make them starve, that's like winning maybe three battles against them. I care about that region. It can just go to hell. I don't know why I repaired it. Just destroy it. Maybe it repaired automatically. Fountains, repair that. Camel farm, yep, keep that. Yeah, whatever. Ready for orders. Odds are still in our favour, but um, there's a chance that if I press this, it'll say defeat. Good. We lost a ship, no big deal. It's just one ship. Okay, we take this off the Sassanids. Ready for orders. It's a possibility that they'll starve. No, they didn't. I guess we just didn't take enough, away enough food. What about Susa? Does that have food? Yep, no. Um, Tessaphon. Sabahan. Nashan. It's got a bit of food. Okay, but I think we'll end the video there. Could send my navies down here to finish them off. Seems like more effort than it's worth, though. No, it's not. Let's go kill the bastard. Couldn't escape. Hard on the oars, you men. We hunger for battle. Good. So that weakens Macron. In fact, I don't think anyone now owns a coastal region, except for me. I don't think there's any coastal regions in the uh, Caspian. Oh no, except for the last one is, is right there. And some desolate territories, and of course it's Britannia. Anyway guys, I think that'll be a good place to end the video. So, we've got how many settlements? 153. Anyway guys, that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe, part 108 is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.